Why do Filipino martial artists mano? Hi everybody, this is Chief Francis from Filipino Martial Arts School. And today we're going to be talking about why in Filipino martial arts we don't bow per se, but we mano. Now, first of all, mano means to, uh, it's, it's hand, right? But to mano means to take your, the, the, the person you respect's hand and place their knuckles or the, the back of the, 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 the top of their hand gently into your forehead. This is, this is a part of the, the, uh, Kind of like a, a, a part of the Catholic, Roman Catholic belief and a Christian belief of getting blessings, right? Um, and now let me just kind of, from what I understand, and I, I could be possibly wrong, but from what I understand, that this is kind of amalgamation of both the the, the Asian uh, beliefs that we have, that you know our ancestors are watching over us, our elders are watching over us, and then in, in the combination of of the Christian beliefs. So. One of the things that in the Filipino culture, not just Filipino martial arts culture, we mano to our elders. We we ask their blessings from our elders because that's the that's the ancestral connection that we have, and it's a very Asian, very very Chinese like um, type of uh, uh, belief structure. Um, so we we as Filipinos, still being Asian and being you know being a melting pot of other Asian um, uh, nations or other Asian cultures. We've adapted that to to include that into our Christianity. Uh, now, if mo most people don't know, uh, most people know this that the Philippines is predominantly Roman Catholic, but not everybody is Roman Catholic. For example, myself and my family, I'm actually a Methodist, uh, and there's also a, a strong, a, a large population of of, of, of Muslims. Uh, living in the Philippines, um, but yes, but part of the reasons why in Filipino martial arts, as compared to other martial arts where they where they they bow, right? Um, in Filipino martial arts, they, they we we take we mano to our to our instructors, we mano to our to our, our to our elders. Now, why is it that I'm 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 instituting that? Well, I just mentioned that this is a very Filipino thing to do. This is Filipino martial arts, so this is something that we incorporated within uh, within Filipino martial arts. But the reason why, and I, and this is uh, this is definitely across the board from all the, all styles of martial arts, is that when you're showing respect to somebody who chooses to show something uh, to you, it, it, you know that's your ultimate way of of saying thank you, right? Showing respect to to your to your instructors and the people that that came before you. Uh, as to why to do that. So for my students who are even Filipino or not Filipino, I, I teach them the, the benefits and the cultural uh, significance of manoing, including when they meet my mother, they mano to her. And they call her grandmaster, even though she's not a martial artist. But because she's my mother, we call her grandmaster. But, but part of that is that connection. If we're gonna, if if what I teach my students came from my elders, from my instructors, then then of course they still have to they they, they by manoing to me they mano to everybody before me. Again, that's part of that the Asian uh, understand uh, you know uh, uh, f uh, faith tradition where our our ancestors watch over us, and so that's a way for us saying when we mano to our elders, when we mano to our instructor, we're we're asking blessings from everybody that came before before. For me and every and you know and all the ancestors prior to that, um, and to me it's also very, it's a unique thing. It's it's a unique thing that we adapted into our culture uh, the, to into FMA where we're showing them that this is how we show respect within the Filipino uh, culture. I don't know. Do you guys agree? Uh, do you believe that manoing is the proper way to show respect to your martial arts instructor? Please comment down below. And if you're looking for a school that's within uh, Orange County or Riverside County, please visit us at www.fmaschool.com. Until next time, this is Chief Francis from Filipino Martial Arts School. Peace out, God bless, and keep swinging them sticks.